flawless design, intense action. Whoever designed this game deserves a pat on the back. Huh? Huh? Another game to test? Well, at least the disc is flashy. <laughs> That's because we're scoping out hotties and cuties. Studying can wait. I should have known. Hotties and cuties for you, Sammy. For me? Why didn't you say so? <sighs> Check out that super hottie. <laughs> he looks totally jockey, but I'm kind of looking for someone majorly brainy. Don't be so judgy, Sammy. How about him? <sighs> or him? I am! That one's too cool for school. That one thinks he's way hot, but he's so not. <gasps> but that one just might be Mr. Right! More like Mr. Yeah Right to you! He is way out of your league! But if you're boy shopping, Sammy, I can lend you one of my hand-me-downs. <laughs> Thanks, Mandy. But she doesn't need your second-hand boys. Besides, after dating you, they're probably damaged good. Hey, how about that super cutie? I guess he's cute in a grandpa sort of way. Ladies, I'm Dean Warden, and it has come to my attention that there were three students roaming around campus very late at night. Well, Dean, why don't you tell someone in charge? I am in charge, and it's Mr. Warden, the new Dean of Students. <laughs> and I'm quite sure it was you three. In fact, I have the footage right here. Huh? <gasps> 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 A well-balanced whoop, if ever I saw one. Jerry, there's this weird warden guy who's like this total busybody. But don't worry, I have just the gadget that will alert you when this Dean fellow is approaching. A uh, chair? A penny for your thoughts as to how this penny will help. Because I so can't make heads or tails of it. This is a state-of-the-art mini penny tracker. Worth a lot more than one cent, I assure you. Once placed on the Dean's person, an alarm will sound on your compounders when the tracker is near. Cool! If only someone had placed one of these devices on the prominent video game developer who has gone missing under rather strange circumstances. Strange? What do you mean? Security footage doesn't show the gamer leaving the company premises, and his whereabouts are unknown. I need you to investigate at once. But first things first, it's gadget time. A totally tough as nails polish remover, able to remove layers of thick concrete with one application. A heat-seeking hairdryer, hot enough to melt anything in its path, and signal-jamming earbuds. Music to my ears! Quite the contrary. They produce digital waves powerful enough to crash the most stable of digital platforms. And speaking of platforms... <laughs> we had to land on the roof instead of going through the front door like normal people? Because we're not normal people, we're totally spies. And the games they make in this building are over the top secret. They wouldn't be too psyched to find us snooping around. Done! Which is why they'll never know we're here. <gasps> Unless they have ears. <gasps> Sounds like we just landed in a major battleground. The good news is they probably didn't hear us cave in their roof. Let's check it out. Huh? So this is the major battleground? Just a gaggle of gamers geeking out? Yes, but with their eyes glued to their screens, they won't spot us snooping around. I know what you're doing here. <gasps> you do? Yeah. You broke in dressed as orbs from Planet Glurg, hoping to get Seth Nathan to autograph your game. Uh, yep, that's what we did. Wait, what's an orb? Where's Planet Glurg and who's Seth Nathan? Only the greatest game designer in Silicon Valley, but he's gone missing. We're all worried because he never leaves the compound. He practically lives in his office. Well, since we did come all the way from Glurg to meet Seth, maybe you could show us where his office is? 
Sorry, off limits. You're gonna have to leave. Avatar adjustment accepted. <laughs> Toby, leave my avatar alone. Don't you dare change me into a troll. <laughs> lives in here, but there's no shower? This uber nerd must uber reek. <gasps> he's not an uber nerd. He's a geek chic super cutie. Too bad he's unavailable. Really unavailable. Looks like something broke out of his screen. Now that's some serious 3D action. Look at Seth's sensitive eyes. I'll bet wherever he is, he's really scared. <laughs> <gasps> Hopefully not as scared as you, Sam. Guys, that door slammer was just snooping on our snooping. After him! <laughs> I know we cut a hole in the roof, but there's no way it's snowing inside. We're in Cali. Some sloppy geek probably spilled their slushy drink. Well, if that drink was slushy, why aren't our clothes soggy? Maybe the guy with the glowing disc in his hand knows. This is not the kind of boy chasing I had in mind. Whoever he was, we better send whatever this is to Jer for analysis. Good idea. Let's grab a sample and go. <laughs> There's the Dean. Time for another dumpster dive. was majorly close and majorly gross. If we don't get that tracking penny on him, this Dean problem will be tough to get rid of. Ugh. Not as oh. tough as it'll be to get rid of that smell. P.U. <sighs> hey, he's totally spying on us. Come on, guys, we can do this. Slipping a penny on the Dean will be a cakewalk. <gasps> Huh? Oh? Is anyone in here? Finally, we can conduct our spy business without the Dean sticking his nose where it doesn't belong. <gasps> in the Dean's bad books. Isn't it funny how trouble just seems to find you losers? Nah. Yet we so can't avoid you. <gasps> and the paparazzi just can't avoid me. I'll get more free pub if I look like I'm avoiding them. Ah, no pictures, no, really, no. I don't believe what I'm seeing. Yeah, this is a new low even for Mandy. No, I mean the Dean is right there and our compounders didn't go off. I can't believe Jerry cheaped out on the penny tracking device. Come on, the whoop chopper is waiting. Whoa! Ladies, there's trouble lurking. Forget trouble. There's a Dean lurking. Your tracking thingy is a dud, Jer. That creepy warden crept up on us without warning. What's that about? Right question, wrong topic. A game developer making an in-store appearance to promote her latest video endeavor is under attack in Tokyo. You need to find out what that's about at once. We're all over it, Jer. Kinda like that Dean is all over us because of your lousy penny tracker. Hmm. Ta-ta! on virtual reality. Because it is reality. Maybe it's just some over-the-top publicity stunt to get the crowd stoked for her game. Hey, 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 hey. If it is, the stunt crashed. The customers are totally freaked out. That's the frostiest looking snowman ever. That was quite the disappearing act. Well, time to melt some snow. <laughs> 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 
because our rescue mission was a major bust. I hope the surveillance monitor isn't majorly busted, because we need to find that snow creature and that guy with the out-of-controller. No need. I slipped the tracking penny in his pocket during the fight. Yeah! Yeah! Way to unpick his pocket. Okay, let's recap what we know. There's a freaky snowman on the loose, which might explain that slushy stuff we found back at the gaming lab. But we still don't know why someone would want to make two game developers disappear. Hmm? Girls, things are escalating rapidly. There are more gaming developers missing. I should also inform you that the snowy substance you sent was not frozen water, but a high-tech simulated snow made to look and feel real, but unable to be melted at any temperature. Thanks, Jer. We'll save Seth, whatever it takes. And the other gamers? Oh, yeah, yeah, them too. <laughs> Garage in the burbs? Not exactly the scary evil lair I was picturing. Coast seems clear. <gasps> and I was wrong. This place is scary, scary, messy. Ew, 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 ew. Huh? Ugh. Hey, look what I found. Wow, Sammy, that sock is so stinky, it's glowing green. So you found the green disc, Sam. We don't have time for some lame game. We need to find some lame gamers. Ah! Seth isn't lame. <laughs> I mean, let's see what the game is. Help! Oh, no! Help! 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 Huh? This is no game, but it's gonna be game over for them if we don't help. Good pep talk, Sam. But we need to get in the game by getting in the game. I wonder what kind of twisted, evil, messy genius would do this. I would. <laughs> Who are you? Skip Joystick. And what are you doing in my mom's garage? And what are you doing in your mom's garage? Aren't you a little old? You're right. I shouldn't be living here. I should be in a mansion living off the millions made for my video game creations. But they were all rejected by the so-called gaming gurus you see trapped in the game, begging for their lives. For a guy who looks like he should be used to rejection, you don't handle it well. Why should I? They're all fools for not knowing gaming gold when they see it. Look at these. Sonic Ultra Button Bash, Turbo Empty Can Recycling Race, and the Pièce de Résistance. I have created a technology that released the character from my greatest gaming invention, Raging Snowman's Xmas Revenge. And while my cold-hearted snow creature wreaks havoc, those gamers are being controlled by me. How can a guy smart enough to create techie stuff like that be lame enough to create games as weak as those? Whatevs. You can explain it to whoop authorities. Skip joystick answers to no authority. Except my mom. Well, you better tell her you're going to be late for dinner for the next 10 to 20 years. <laughs> no! Enjoy the game, ladies. Nothing, Mother. Ah! 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 <sighs> nice catch and such strong arms. Huh? Thanks. <laughs> uh, sorry to spoil your moment, but we need to get out of here right now. This world is pixelating around us. <laughs> I can't believe this is happening. Actually, it's quite believable but it requires a fundamental understanding of hexadecimal language, which is easier to comprehend than binary code, but a whole lot harder than English. <laughs> oh, sure. Now you figure out how to flirt? <laughs> the technical difficulties you're experiencing are about to end permanently. The game will crash, 
depixelating into a blank void of nothing, taking you with it in 30 seconds. <laughs> oh. Come on, guys. Pull it together. We need an exit strategy, like right now. Come on, Brainiacs, we can do this. We've been playing games as dangerous as this our whole lives. Let's show everyone what we're really made of. I know a way out. 67, 6F, 20, 74, 68, 61. You guys speak hexi language, right? Oh, I do. But can you translate for my friends while we run for our lives? <laughs> guys! <laughs> <laughs> hey, that might be our portal out of this game. And that frozen water slide might just be our ticket to reach it. <laughs> that almost hit me! <laughs> Better put on ear protection. Like these signal jamming earbuds. Of course! Jerry is a genius. Oh, is Jerry your boyfriend? <laughs> what are you laughing at? You have four seconds until you're permanently deleted. Yeah? Huh? Did you take out the trash like I asked you to? Not now, Mother. I'm in the middle of something very important. Come on, guys. Time to plow the snow and get to that portal. <laughs> monitor in her garage. Oh, I'm gonna be so grounded. But it'll be worth it to see you destroy. They're gonna destroy us? I have two words to say to that. Huh? And Liz? Ew! You ruined my outfit? Oh, now it's personal. Don't. Huh? Mommy, mommy, mommy! Sorry, Skip, but your game has a bug huh? in it. And you know what you do with the bug? You squash it! <gasps> no! Everything huh? okay in there? Uh, yeah. Just hanging out with some new friends, Mom. Yeah, and you'll be hanging out with some newer friends at Woo. <clears throat> Listen, um, Sam, I was wondering if maybe you'd want to, you know, uh, go out sometime uh, with me. <gasps> I know this cute little vintage arcade that has these old school video games and... That sounds fun. It does? I, I mean... <clears throat> Thank you. <laughs> Mission accomplished, spies. Make that two missions accomplished. Save some lives and got a date. And the stealth mode on the Whoop Chopper helped us avoid the nosy Dean. Until now! <gasps> we'll sneak in through the back entrance. <gasps> Two Deans? That's way worse than one. 
And that's why the penny tracker didn't seem to work. And why it seemed like there are two of you. There are two of you. So, which one of you deans is the kinder, gentler warden? Sneaking in through a prohibited back door, I think a pink slip is very appropriate. Remember, we're always, always watching, watching you. you. Great. Now we're going to have to try twice as hard to avoid their prying eyes. Alex, what are you doing? Just making sure there isn't another Dean on the loose. They could be triplets, or quadruplets, or quintuplets. 